uh, stands for Breakable Experimental Network. It is a uh, dark fiber that connects uh, the sites uh, on the campuses of several universities here in the Triangle University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill, uh, Duke University in North Carolina State, and Renzi's main offices. It is a platform for networking research for the community um, of researchers here in the Triangle. Um, it's breakable because it is unencumbered by production traffic. Uh, most of the test beds typically have in parallel running uh, production traffic for, uh, for uh, researchers as well as some experimental traffic. Ben, it, with Ben we're fortunate enough to uh, have our own dark fiber on which uh, Ben's traffic is segregated from the rest of the infrastructure and therefore it allows us to play with various disruptive technologies, both networking and application level. Uh, and uh, create uh, experiments that are otherwise impossible on other types of infrastructure. Uh, as a true networking testbed, Ben hosts a variety of networking equipment, some of which was acquired in partnership with Infinera Corporation. Now, this richness of equipment allows us to create very interesting experiments on Ben. However, uh, in order to make this the job of creation of these experiments easier, we needed a software to control this, this rich infrastructure. So in fact, uh, controlling such an infrastructure is exactly the idea behind the NSF Genie. And uh, uh, at Duke University, Professor Jeff Chase has been working on this problem for quite a while. He has developed a prototype of uh, software called ORCA, Open Resource Control Architecture, which in partnership with Renzi, we are now um, adop uh, adapting to uh, control uh, Ben equipment. Uh, so in essence, what we're doing is building a smaller version of Genie, or what we call a Genie Island. MIN is a very sophisticated network monitor monitoring system um, through the use of visualization uh, in, in the front end combined with multi-touch technology and on a very large, um, not landscape necessarily, but a very large um, screen, um, we're trying to uh, bring network monitoring to a, a new level, really. To illustrate how MIN is used, we would uh, typically and compare and contrast this with typical uh, network mon monitoring and network management. Um, it, as we said before, it's much more intuitive. Um, we're not going through charts and tables and, and trying to identify things through just some color-coded text, but actually making it more, much more efficient and easing the, the, um, the operation itself and making it easier to use for someone to learn about networking and also to use it even at an expert level. One of the big strengths behind MIN is um, making it much more intuitive, making it easier for the operator, for the engineer to, to go in and, and really you know, put their hands on the network and, and, and feel its heartbeat.